Hey yo, this is Bot here. Welcome to another video of unboxing and rating another product. And what we have here is the Milwaukee Combo Toolkit, valued at $515. <laughs> and that says if purchased separately. But here we have the M18 high torque impact wrench half drive. And we also have here another uh, 3 8 ratchet M12 ratchet and we're gonna unbox this right now and see what we got all right well, let's go ahead and start unboxing this there we go it's already in the bag and it also has a identifier Milwaukee so let you know what kind of tools in there so right. oh. the zipper is a little bit of a, a pest all right so three instruction sheets Impact wrench, ratchet, battery charger, brochure, let you know what kind of products they got. There's a battery charger. Core is probably about, looks like about four or five feet long. Has a socket there for the impact wrench battery. Socket there for the ratchet battery and two light indicators. Let you know what the status is of those charges. Now I've already charged the two batteries, so it took about an hour, about an hour and a half to charge them up completely. But it's a good thing to have these battery indicators because uh, you don't want to start a job and you only got like two battery lights left. And then all of a sudden you have to quit and go charge your battery. Hopefully you got a second battery by that time. Here's the ratchet battery. There's no indicator, so there's nothing to tell you where it's at. But we'll figure that out, figure that out in just a minute. This is what I really wanted. This half inch drive, 450 foot torque. What do I mean? 450 foot pound torque gun impact wrench. Exactly what I needed, so. There's the other one direction. Now here's the other direction. It's pretty heavy, bulky in bottom. Of course, keep up with your battery battery life. It does have a lot of torque on it though. Switch to the other side and you see it here too. So it's a little heavy. Might wear your arms out if you're using it for you know for long duration. But being a half inch drive, I mean, you're gonna need all of the power that this thing can get to pull off axle you know axle nuts and maybe get some of those tired lug nuts off so any any job involving a car this would be good for it any other work um with high you know with something that has a lot of high foot pounds on the torque that that gun that this should be able to take it off in no time one more a ratchet it's pretty bulky you know, it's like a flashlight so let's put the battery in there's a little flashlight now I will say though um, there's a really cool thing that I've seen is that there's a lock 
and there's a, to unlock it. No, it doesn't work. Well, it does, but it's unlock to so that you don't inadvertently do something. And then when you're ready to use it, unlock it. And then you switch to the other direction. <laughs> kind of old-fashioned look, design, you know, from the old ratchets from the 70s and 80s and such. Still actually used today, but some of them are a little bit more modern now. They actually have a click, a clicker on the bottom of these things. <laughs> Instead of just turning it with your two fingers but switch to the other direction now there is a light down here now that's your battery life your battery health indicator so it just tells you how what your what charges your battery's at and so it's full charged so it's ready to go a flashlight would be helpful especially at night time now I will say that I don't think this is really good for under the hood operations. <laughs> maybe for maybe taking like valve cover nuts off or something, but if you gotta go dig deep down into the underneath the hood, you know, underneath the you know behind the engine well and all that, this would not be good for it. It's just too bulky. Um, it's not long enough, and I just don't think it would be helpful in those situations so you have to get another ratchet, a skinny ratchet, a manual turn ratchet instead of one of these. It looks good. Another thing I will mention about this about this bag is that it does have pockets so if you want to add more little tools, clamps, uh, measuring tape and you know, a gasket maker and all that. Um, you can add that in here as well. And these pockets are on both sides. So, it looks like there's a little tiny little part in here. Well, that wasn't part of the include included parts. But I definitely need it though. It's an adapter from looks like three eighths to a quarter inch, so it's connected to your ratchet. Any of those small little bolts, um, probably something like a valve cover nuts on your car. There probably would be like probably about a quarter quarter inch nuts, and so did a quarter inch. Adapter from the 3 8 would be able to pull those off. And anything else, any like little uh, screws and you know uh, other nuts from maybe the lawnmower too, which I will also use this for as well. So that's really neat. I like that. It wasn't part of it. It didn't say that it was included, but it's nice to have. Nice to know that it's going to be there when you need it. So, this is what you get. You get two batteries. They're already attached. Ratchet and pack wrench. And a battery charger. This is a really good deal in my opinion because this is only going to cost you $199 at Home Depot. $199. Now, most of the time, these parts these tools come by themselves they don't usually come with the battery I don't know why they do they do it that way so the, the fact that you can buy a kit that comes with the charger with the batteries that's a plus you don't have to go do separate shopping for stuff it's all in one kit forget about it just run to the store buy it $199 is not too much and uh, one thing I will say though is that I love Milwaukee brands. I've always been a user of Milwaukee products. Uh, I've used their torque gun, uh, which, which I was saying that the, the original corded uh, impact wrench that I had was about this long. So the fact that I got this is even better because it's a little bit shorter.
and I can run it underneath the car and start taking, you know, some, do some nut busting on some of these parts. <laughs> so that's a plus. It's a little bit sh smaller in length, but it's got everything I want. So I have to buy a, se a second battery for that in case uh, I have a uh, a lot of work to do. So I would say this is a good buy. Uh, it's a good starter kit in my opinion if you wanted an impact wrench and and if you decide that you want a ratchet to go along with it then it comes with it so I'm not knocking all the other brands DeWalt and uh, Nick was it Makita and Husqvarna and all them others Craftsman uh, them they make good good they make good products too but I would stick to Milwaukee because you know I've never had a part I've never had a tool that broke down on me so and I use them pretty heavy duty, so by the time you see this again, it'll be used to knock some, take something off. <laughs> Anyways, thank you, and uh, I'll see you on the next video. As far as a rating for the, this actual product, um, this is just for the kit. Now that individually, I will have to give ratings for these tools, but as far as being a gift. Um, I would have to give it a five star because it, like I said, uh, individually you'd have to buy these tools by themselves without their batteries. So the fact that you buy the kit, uh, it's a really good buy. So a five star rating just for the product itself of, of the kit that includes everything you need so that you don't have to go through all the legwork of buying the batteries, which are separate. And sometimes you can buy the kit as a battery charger and the battery itself. But sometimes they're sold separately. So I'd have to give it a five star rating just because you get all of it. No leg work involved. Alright, thank you.